Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I will be just telling you a little bit about this wig as well as showing you the inside of the cap and its construction and showing you the clips and all the good stuff on the inside and how well this wig was constructed. This hair is from All Love Hair. They sent me um, 130 density straight 22 inch uh Remy wig it was a hundred and a hundred percent human hair so if you'd like to get some gorgeous virgin hair definitely check the links in the description box they have a whole bunch of different textures lengths and so on and so forth as it relates to wigs and hair bundles and frontals and closures and all that good stuff so just keep watching the videos if you'd like to see how the wig looks on the inside, like the construction. It's actually super stretchy by the way, so if you have a really big head, all love hair got you girl. They got you. This wig on the whole is a glueless wig. So that's another reason to purchase it because it is 100% glueless. Once you lift it up, it stays down. You don't need got to be spray, you don't need moves, you don't need anything. And I'm pretty sure once you secure your baby hairs down every day once you, when you wear this wig, that's enough um, to hold your wig down in place or even just like this because the cap is pretty snug and tight. So without further ado, let's just get into the video. So, um, as you can see, some of my hair is crimped, some is not. So we're going to get into crimping the front. So, honestly, this process has been a semi-breeze, semi-not really. Oh, my comb is all the way over there, so hold up. This wig is from I Love Hair. So it's like A-L and then Love hair all together like in one they sent me a 130 percent density wig and right now that's what i have on my head i won't be doing any types any type of baby hairs because i don't want it to take away from the crimps if you get what i'm saying i'm trying to keep it mature these days uh try to use less baby hair um or as little baby hair as possible so this wig is basically glueless like 
I don't have a cap underneath it, but it is glueless, so you could pull it off and it just sticks right there. No elastic band, no got to be sprayed, none of that. And I mean, if you're like me, where you don't have crazy friends or crazy people coming up to you, touching your hair every five seconds or touching your hair, period, you should be good with this wig on your head and feeling secure because even though I'm only using the band that's actually on the inside of the wig, it feels super secure. Uh, I don't feel like my wig is about to fall off in any like any minute now just because I don't have no type of people coming up, touching, doing all sorts of crazy stuff to my wig. So that's that on that. And I feel like these crimps, they honestly, because this crimper is so tiny, it's a tiny baby crimper. Because it's so tiny, it takes a while to crimp the hair. But as you can see, as soon as I crimp it, it becomes super shiny, silky. Once you put heat on it, it just like, you know, goes with the flow of life, which is crimps at this point so that's cute so this is all I'm doing to my hair I showed it in the previous clip and this is basically the front I didn't want to do the front because I was low-key contemplating on if I should do baby hairs or not and I was just like yeah no baby hairs because I'm not going to straighten this hair, even though it is a straight wig, I also um, had it just washed and blow dried just so the crimps could have more volume to it because it is a 130 density wig. I wouldn't straighten it unless I was going to cut it, even though it would have been like sleek and really super lightweight for the summertime. Um, that's cool and all but we still want some type of volume to our hair we want our hair to look full enough when when i say volume i mean full we want our hair to look full so it honestly did not make sense to um straighten this wig because i know it wouldn't look that full or as thick as i would have wanted it to be trust me this style takes a lot of dedication and if you're not about that life, or if you easily get tired of doing something, just go to a professional at this point and ask for some crimps, cause baby, this takes too long. Just pay for it to be done. But if you wanna do this in the comfort of your own home, hey, what's good, sweetie? <laughs> Sit back and relax and watch how the heck I get my crimps to be so crimpalicious. Okay, all right, that's, that's wild. Um, but no, yeah, if you want to do this in the comfort of your own home, for free, for the frizzle, for the love, I got my crimping iron from the beauty supply store, <laughs> where else could I have gotten it from, and yeah, so I'll be back when I'm done with this crimp and the other side. Okay y'all, so I am back. Do y'all like it? Giving very much wild-ish vibes or whatever. So, the wig went from pretty straight and lifeless because it was like washed and blow dried and poofy to Lion Queen was good because we look tamed just a little bit but it's cute i really like it crimps are a vibe an acquired vibe though because sometimes i like it like in certain angles i like the hair and in certain angles i'm just like hmm, i don't know yet like it's getting there I'm starting to feel myself a little bit more. So the brand that this hair is from is called All Love Hair. Um, it was their Remy Straight 13x4 
22 inch lace front wig it was a hundred and thirty percent density it is a hundred percent human hair it is soft it had a natural hairline with full ends of course and uh, you can always go in and cut your ends I've seen a couple videos where people do go in and clip up their ends so they could be thicker but this is full enough for me and my gorgeous crimps so yeah i didn't do any baby hairs and this is glueless so you could pull it down as low as you want it if you have a huge forehead or you could pull it back for it to look super natural and i didn't want to add baby hairs because i feel like this wig is good without it you don't really need it to top off anything it's actually perfect just like this and yeah so all in all this hair is really really gorgeous silky it straightens amazing like when i tell you this hair gets super duper bone straight with some high heat on yeah one pass and this hair was bone straight and i guess that has to do with the density of the wig so yeah that's it for this video so thank you so much for watching if you guys would like to purchase this wig, which I would definitely recommend, check the description box for the links to all of here uh, and this wig that I have on. If you want to